I mean, there's a lot of important tournaments during the season, but the World Championship is the one that everybody look up at. You know, like everybody, I try to get like the title, and cause, you know, it's very prestigious to to every skier. When I won my first one, you know, I was like. Not a surprise. I mean, I I knew I could have done, could have, could do it. Um, but then the hardest part is like to not, you know. I mean, people expect more from you. So I won one. I got second in Canada, and then I won again. Um, I mean, anything comes is good for me. You know, I, I'm happy that I'm sitting in this spot right now. And as I said, it will be very tough because. There's a lot of good skiers, and but I don't think that whenever I'm sitting on the dock, I'm gonna think about, oh, I have to defend the title. I'm just gonna go out there and, and do what I do, do what I love, and, and give my best, and hopefully it'll go well. Well, I had a bit of a, a crisis last year when I wasn't quite getting the scores um, just over a year ago. And so I sort of set myself a target, you know, I need to make that top 20. So I did a load of ranking tournaments, just tried to get those big scores. And um, I saw the, the world ranking list at whenever it was published in December or whatever, and, and sort of knew I'm halfway there. So then waited up for it to come out in the April list and came, I think, 13th. So I knew I was qualified and I uh, certainly had a bit of a celebration, you know, I was super happy to be, to be confirmed to get over there because, you know, that I'd have been absolutely gutted to be at, you know, 23 and not be able to ski in the world. Yeah. You know, I'd love to be able to have a go at the big guys and see see if I can take a few scalps. <laughs> um, I haven't been in this situation before so it definitely uh, adds on a little bit of pressure but uh, um, I'm just gonna get ready the same way as I did uh, two years ago and uh, because obviously it proved to work really well so I'm just gonna keep doing what I was doing and uh, hope for the best. You know, I actually started thinking about it in 2009 where I had a really good world and ended up second and uh, it kind of slipped uh, to the back of my mind to where I was like, man, I was actually really close and I could win the world one year, one day, you know, and um, I just uh, set my mind on that goal and kind of got ready for it and made it happen two years later.